Sure looks like you kids have gotten tough. What are you doing in a place like this? I've come with a job to offer you. I'll have to give this one a hard pass, thanks. Sure about that? Left unchecked, this could be Akihabara's undoing. It's pretty dire stuff. What do you mean? An enemy of unknown form has revealed itself. So you guys gotta get out there and do your hero thing. If it's got an unknown form, where has it revealed itself? And how do you even know it's there? It's somewhere in Akihabara. Likely possessing a hapless someone or other. Find that someone and talk up a good show with them. You'll be able to see their true colors in no time. Anyway, best of luck. Your call, Tachibana. This has bad news stamped all over it, in neon letters. We can't just turn a blind eye to it, though. Her claim is much too serious for that. Let's go look around, Asahi. Huh? We don't want anything, I swear. So, you have sensed my presence. Mike? Hold on. Something's not right with her. Could it be you simply don't yet know? Left behind in this world. A nameless delusion. Hey! Asahi, wait. I think she may be the person Sharika was describing. It's somewhere in Akihabara, likely possessing a hapless someone or other. Find that someone and talk up a good show with them. You'll be able to see their true colors in no time. So Mike is our enemy of unknown form then? It would certainly explain what just happened. Then we have to go look for her before the trail goes cold. Never seen this door before. Is this the entrance to a delusion scape? Yeah, some nameless delusion, probably. Unnoticed by everyone up till now. And Mike's inside, you think? We should go in and find out. Not so fast. We have no idea what might be lurking in there. If we're going in, we have to be sure we're well prepared. What the hell is this place? The Nameless Delusionscape. Pretty nondescript, isn't it? Just as the name implies. It has no personality whatsoever. I wonder what's waiting for us in here. Hey, see that door? Don't you want to One hostile sighting. How about we sneak right past it? I see an enemy! See an enemy! This is why I call them Pierces. Just Two hostile bodies! Just two! And get no what? Problem. It's clobber inside! You were able to come here. Who the hell are you? That is the question, isn't it? What am I? Who am I? What manner of existence is this?
How should we know? Exactly. Which is why I'm here. The answers I seek may rest within this place. Okay, but you can at least give back Nikkei's body, can't you? She's got nothing to do with this, right? Indeed. This girl is not but a vessel. You all right, Mike? Why, why am I here? Allow me to explain. What does all this mean? I don't understand. Yeah, we were kind of hoping you did because we're pretty much at a loss ourselves. Why would I? How could I? This is all so crazy. Mike, what happened to your speech style? What? You mean all the yeah, yes? Well, you must have noticed how old that gets after a while. Besides, it's not like I'm in public. Nobody knows where the hell we are, do they? So why should I stay in character? I only took this job because the pay was good. But let me tell you, being a cat maid all the time is a major pain. So much for professionalism. Uh, what is that supposed to mean? You guys aren't guests, right? So I'm off the clock. I'm not serving anyone right now. But ooh, just keep this all on the DL, okay? Sorry, babe. No can do. I'm loose-lipped. I sink ships. What the heck is that thing? That cute little uggo. Oof, words. Like daggers. Wait. If Pinkoon's bothering you, that means you can see him. Being possessed has allowed you to perceive delusions. Ugh. I have got to be dreaming. I'm not the type of girl who believes in this kind of stuff. All the more reason you should join us. What? Why? Because maids are always welcome. Yeah, no. I, I mean, I work for a living, not to advance some RPG plot, thank you. Maybe this will change your mind? What the? A voice recorder? <laughs> That's right. I've been recording everything. Your true nature lay bare for all to hear. You are going to erase that right now, you little pup ass. If you want it erased, you're going to have to join up with Master Pinkoon's retinue. What do you mean, join up? What are you guys into? I mean, back us up. A nice, simple job supporting the team. So, a little give and take then. I accompany you, you erase the tape. Oh, and it's very important that you support us with all the spirit of a true maid. So, get to meowing, little kitty. What? Why? Why? Would you prefer I let all of Akihabara hear your beautiful, natural voice? I, I, oh, you can't. Then fall in line behind Master Pinkoon. Oh, fine, I get it. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. don't you mean fine? I get it. What is your major meow function? That'll do, Kitty. That'll do. Um, is this really okay? Feels kind of like blackmail to me. Sorry, Asahi. I thought I'd raise Pinkun better than this. I don't know where I went wrong. Considering she's now going to be a part of the repeating Sunday, though, I think it is safer for her to stick with us. Yeah, that's true enough. That being the case, uh, welcome to the party, Mike. Welcome, he says. Well, for meow, I'll just have to do my best to cheer you on. I kind of have to, right? Ahem. <clears throat> While you've all been standing here terrorizing the cat girl, our enemy of unknown form has been getting away. Don't worry. We'll catch up with it and tear it to pieces. Well, it's still in here somewhere, so it's probably safe to head out and regroup if we need to. But let's be quick. There it is. Whatever this enemy is, it's about to be an X enemy. Don't hold back. This is completely unlike anything we've fought so far. There's no telling what it can do. Let's get this over with. One fierce Oh, look at me. I'm shaking my no little problem. booty. I see this. Come on. Come on.
Is it over? What in the world was that thing? Let's report back to Sharako and see if we can find out. Surprised you folks were really able to take it down. What the heck was that thing? The Nameless Delusion. Okay. So what does that mean exactly? A shared delusion. That sense of vague sadness and unease we all got inside of us. The feeling that something's wrong, but you don't know what. Which is why the delusion's got no real form of its own. So why did it possess Mike? Must have felt lonely. Lonely? The feeling's got no name, and nobody wants to accept it. So the delusion, too, is unnamed and unloved. Yet it's always been there, inside every one of us, right in front of our eyes, but as alone as can be. So it took over Mike's body to make itself known, to find its identity. But if we defeated it, doesn't that mean... Oh, heavens no! It may be ephemeral as anything, but it's a being of incredible strength. It won't ever truly be gone. See? Take a gander over that away. What? Why is it here? I should think that's obvious. It's here so we can participate in the Might Club. From now on, you can challenge it again and again to your heart's content. For a nominal fee, of course. Not running a charity here. All that turmoil. She gives us a repeatable boss encounter. Goody.